What's the worst pain you've experienced? A broken bone. Touching something hot. Maybe stepping on a sharp toy. In this experiment, you'll find how true suffering feels. What is the most excruciating pain you could have? What kinds of agony would you experience? And how could this anguish be beneficial to you? Your body's way of informing you when something is wrong is pain. It's the outcome of lightning fast nerve to brain communication. Pain occurs in a variety of sizes and shapes, and everyone has a unique experience with it. It can feel like a throbbing, stabbing, or constant aching sensation. It can also make you feel nauseous, irritable, or even depressed. So brace yourself. You're about to enter a world of extreme pain. Childbirth. The pain you feel in childbirth is from contractions of the uterus and pressure on the cervix. Once your water breaks and you're in full labor, this pain only gets worse. You'd experience cramping under your belly. Or pain radiating all around could be so bad that you'd have tunnel vision and tune out everything around you. Delivering your child could feel as if somebody was pulling your internal organs out. Kidney stones. Kidney stones are a hard mineral deposit that forms in your kidneys as a result of chemicals in your urine. You'll feel significant cramping and acute pain on both sides of your lower back if these stones get caught in your ureter. It'd appear out of nowhere. It would then arrive in waves. However, it would feel like a stab in the back. Then there's the twisting of the knife. Toothache. Toothaches are often caused by nerve irritations in the root of a tooth. They can be sharp and sudden. Or a constant throbbing. And sorry to say, they often get worse at night. So if you thought falling asleep would give you some relief, well, you'd be wrong. Cluster headache. Cluster headaches are considered one of the most painful types of headaches. They come from a nerve pathway, in your brain responsible for the sensation of heat and pain in your face. Without warning, you'd feel intense pain in or around one eye. And this burning or piercing feeling could last from 15 minutes to 3 hours. It would pretty much feel like your head is about to split wide open. Broken Femur the femur is the bone in your thigh that stretches from your hip to your knee. If you broke your femur, you'd feel immediate and severe pain. It would take a lot of force to break this bone, so you'd feel it in the hip, back and buttocks too. Feeling would be a mix of deep radiating pain and total numbness. Almost like freezing your leg on the outside while dousing it in flames on the inside. burns. Second degree burns not only affect the top layer of skin but the second layer too. Superficial burns of the second layer of skin are initially the most painful. When the first layer burns off, it leaves nerve endings exposed, and that means even a gentle breeze could cause agony. Appendicitis. Appendicitis is an inflammation of your appendix. You feel a sudden pain in your lower right abdomen that would start to move. Any physical movement could make the pain more severe. So be careful when you cough, or you could feel a sensation similar to multiple knives carving up your insides. Trigeminal Neuralgia There's no way to prepare for it. But when a blood vein presses against the trigeminal nerve, you could be close to one of the most painful feelings possible. It would feel more severe than a heart attack. You would feel a sudden jolt, almost like getting zapped with tons of electricity. At first, it would only be for a few seconds but could start to last longer. It would be so intense that you'd be unable to eat or drink anything. Tetanus. You could become infected with tetanus after a puncture injury such as stepping on a nail. It's caused by a bacteria that produces a poison resulting in sudden, involuntary muscle contractions. You'd arch your neck and back. Your legs would stiffen like rocks. And you'd clench your fists tightly for several minutes at a time. Don't fish sting. 
this list wouldn't be complete without some animal kingdom representation. And the 13 spines on the back of the stonefish could inflict a ton of pain onto you. These spines are full of venom. This venom would cause intense swelling around the sting. And that swelling and pain would quickly spread to the whole limb. You'd be so preoccupied with the feeling of a gigantic sledgehammer slamming down on the affected body part that you wouldn't even be able to put your pain into words. Yes, that was intense. After all this pain, you wouldn't be crazy to wish you never experienced pain at all. Hope you liked the video. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to subscribe and never miss out on any of